Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the vlog. It is Monday morning, literally, 8 a.m. I'm just doing some stretches, and the weather is perfect right now to run. It's not too, it's not sunny, right? There's no sun out, but it's not gloomy either. It's not like raining, but the weather, it's like perfect. This is my type of running weather because it's not, what do you call it, human or anything? Just a cool breeze going, so perfect. I'm doing some stretches. I look like a mess because I just got out of bed, but I gotta get myself to run somehow otherwise I, I like i said i've been on i've been off not even on lately so anyways welcome to the vlog guys hope you enjoy and i will catch you all and it's starting to rain maybe i spoke too soon i better hurry up and run mm. Picking up lunch. Hey guys, so I am now resting. It is a little bit exactly four in the afternoon. My dog here, just chilling. Um, it's four in the afternoon. I'm he's looking at himself. It's four in the afternoon. Um, I'm waiting as a podcast. To, yeah, I have a podcast that's hopefully fixing itself right now. Basically, I rendered out the podcast, had it dropped into Dropbox. I may have deleted it too early because I, I realized I exported it in the wrong file format. But in doing so, I messed up the AUP project file, which is AUP is a format for Audacity. Uh, long story short, I corrupted some files for the podcast, which now is not allowing it to open. Luckily, Dropbox stores multiple copies, so I'm hoping that um, the ones I'm restoring right now are the right ones because basically audacity breaks like one big project file into like Hundreds of mini ones. So I'm really hoping I oh, he wants to get off now hoping that uh, The ones I'm restoring are the right ones. Anyways that being said my assistant just went home uh, And I'm waiting for that to get done got a lot done today actually so in review I got the two articles out on digital dojos a podcast out for Monday digital coffee and um what else? And a video. I have a video, a Q&A session video. It, was, it took me like 12 minutes to go through. I'm answering your guys' questions. Uh, so it's going to be coming on this channel. So look forward to that. I know it's a little bit long. and I, I wish I could have done it shorter, but I didn't want to rush my way through. Um, and I, I just wanted to really just answer your guys' questions in, in full detail and all that good stuff. So I'm still sitting here trying to find out how to fix this audio file. I have like snippets of it. And it's... Granted, I've spent more time trying to fix the problem. I could have just re-recorded the whole podcast, which is 20, 22 minutes, give or take. But I was so upset that it crashed that I've spent the last hour and a half trying to fix it. <laughs> so, kind of counterproductive. I took a break, went down to the uh, convenience store, got my dinner for tonight, the bento right here. Um, got some drinks, I got a Red Bull for later if I need it tonight. Um, and some, uh, a couple protein shake things, and this, some strawberry stuff, so, yeah. I really don't want to re-record, but I know I probably should. I'm going to spend ten more minutes on it. I'm actually about to record another product review, and, um, success, I finally found these earbuds after literally, like, two weeks of them missing... Turns out they were in my suit jacket, so the suit I wore today, um, they were in that pocket. And since obviously suits, you don't, you can't uh, wash them, you have to get them dry cleaned. I leave them hanging or in a garment bag, and I don't really check the pockets till I take them to dry cleaning. And today, I found the headphones in them, so uh, success in its own right.
I'm about to film another review here. It looked like uh, Wilson from, is that his name? Is it Wilson from, what's that show called? Home Improvement? I, I don't even know if that was his name. Anyways, <laughs> um, about to record another video. It is now 8.30 at night. And, oh no, you saw my lips. I'm no longer that character. <laughs> Anyways, um, I have another video review to shoot. But this one's a little bit more uh, important because it's going to include a giveaway of five copies of the software. So stay tuned. Uh, check out youtube.com slash digital dojos if you're interested. It's pretty cool software for you iOS users if you have an iPhone and are on Windows or PC or Windows or Mac. Either or really cool software, so be sure to check that out. And success, I finally found these guys after like two weeks of them missing the ear pods. Turns out they're in my suit jacket. You know, obviously since you don't wash suits like um, daily like you would regular clothes, I get them dry cleaned. I don't typically check the pockets so I have to get them dry cleaned. And I had one suit specifically in my closet for a while. Got it work day and found these guys in the pockets. So, got done with the video review and all that, editing it. It's now 9.30 uh, at night. And I'm just going to take a break. Not a considerable amount done today. Um, I decided I'm going to re-record the podcast. I'm deciding whether or not I'm going to do it tonight or just do it tomorrow since technically... Uh, the podcast is weekly and it's going to come out every Monday for you guys in the States, but technically Tuesday here is Monday for you guys, so I have a day to like, give myself some leeway. Um, so either I'm going to record it tomorrow morning or re-record it or re-record it tonight. Uh, probably do it tonight if I can squeeze it in. Alright guys, it is 12.30 and I'm in my bedroom, as you can tell. Um, I've been getting a lot of work done and I just kind of totally spaced out on recording any clips because I, I literally... I've had a really productive day, and that's nothing to... I, I, I'm saying it like it's a bad thing. I got a lot done. In the last couple hours, I got a lot done. And uh, for that reason, I decided to come into the you know the bedroom early and go to sleep early. And yeah, 12.30 is, is like early. 12.30 is like an achievement for me, pretty much. Um, because I never really come in this bedroom unless I'm going to sleep or I just need room and time to think and quiet and disconnected from distractions and computers and all that good stuff. Um, cause this room is literally packed. Like, I know you guys see this angle a lot and sometimes, but this room is like a storage room or used to be a storage room. I put a bed in here and some clothes and that's literally it's just to have a separate office. So one of these days I'll manage to clean out all this crap that's in here. Um, but anyways, uh, like I was saying, really productive day, stepped out early and then was sitting here thinking and, you know, happy in the fact that I'm, I'm resting early. I'm going to get a little bit more extra time to sleep than normal these last couple of weeks but at the same time thinking the fact that like the fact that I'm excited to be inside in my room by 1230 um you know considering it all I, I just did some calculations here normally my, my work day now since I've hired my executive assistant who comes in at 9 a.m. every day to help me with a lot of different things and give me the rundown and all that my work day starts at 9 a.m. so I'm usually up give or take by 8 a.m. run eat breakfast get ready I start the work at 9 a.m., jump through, you know, whatever the tasks are for the day, get done around 4 or 4.30. When the assistant leaves uh, around the time frame, I usually will lay down for like an hour or two. And if not, then I'll go to the gym with friends or do something for an hour, and an hour and a half to two hours. And by 6 o'clock, I'm usually having dinner. Or if I don't go out for dinner with any, you know, the family or whatever, then I'm here and I'm back working again by 6 o'clock. And then that's another six hours typically in my office. And that's being generous uh, because I usually get into my room by 1 to 2 a.m. Again, being on the generous end. So in total, that's about 14 hours of work a day in a 24-hour day. 14 hours within the office at least. Um, now, that's not all 14 hours of pure productivity, mind you, but it is 14 hours in the office nonetheless. Uh, and that's over an 80 hour plus work week and that is ridiculous and if you asked me that you know years ago I probably would have been proud of that that my younger self uh, would have been like you know uh, so proud that I worked that many hours uh, and you know that is a part of being an entrepreneur I like that drive I like that edge I like that that competition and being awake while the other guy's sleeping type thing like that stuff did drive me when I was younger and still drives me to some respect now Otherwise, I wouldn't be working that often. And I still enjoy what I do and, and, and all that. But at the same time, a part of me knows, like, now, like, there's people who, who you know, who work 
way less than that and, and make way more than me. So, you know, it, it's, I talk about this a lot, but it's a lot about efficiency, like 80 hours a week. I want to cut that in half to a 40 hour work week and make three times the amount I'm making now. Um, and I know that's a huge leap and you're not going to get there in one day. It's baby steps. I want to get my business to an automation standpoint. Uh, and the fact that I just don't have to worry and money comes in. And, and the fact not saying I don't have to work, I don't have to worry. Huge difference. See, lately I feel like I've been doing what I, I need to do for my businesses rather than what I want to do uh, in my life in general because I still enjoy what I do. I still enjoy digital dojos. I still enjoy screen cap. Don't get me wrong. But what I'm saying is that a big part of the whole reason me wanting to be an entrepreneur, wanting to own my own businesses, be self-employed, is because you have not just financial freedom, or you can have financial freedom, but you have ultimate freedom to do whatever it is you want in your life, in your lifestyle. And um, right now I've just been really swamped with work and a lot of stuff that I haven't been doing what I want to do. I've been doing what I need to do. Um, and I, I definitely want that to change. And I'm not saying, like I said, it's not, it's not something you just wake up one morning and it's different. It's something you work at. And I'm trying to get to that point. Uh, it's like the next step for me. Uh, in my overall life, both professionally and personally. Um, but yeah, 80 hours plus a week, that's ridiculous. <laughs> that really is. It's its like I'm, I'm getting a lot done, but at the same time, I feel like I'm not getting enough done. Um, and it's not because I'm not, I need to work more hours. It's just I need to change a lot of different things and, and how the whole thing runs as a whole. Anyways, I'm going to head to sleep now. I know there's a long you know, rant for me to close out the vlog. Nonetheless, I appreciate you guys listening as always. I appreciate your views, support, all that good stuff. Hope you're all doing well, and I will catch you all in the next vlog.